Hey YouTubers, how's it going? Today, I'm going to try to go a little back into the past and finish up something that I had actually started here. Uh, I had asked people to write in on Ask Kev Anything to uh, basically ask me questions about different things and that I would answer them. Well, I did get some questions in and I never did answer them. Now, we're going to do it now. I've got three questions, as you can see here. So I'm going to go through all three of these questions and we'll see. And we'll get my opinion on things. First question comes to us from Destron, which says, How come there are so many fake friends out there? Why is everyone so judgmental? Why does life kick you when you're down? Well, this ain't one question. This is three questions. We'll attack it in three parts. The first part is, why are there so many fake friends out there? Well, this is the way the world works. Human beings naturally try to look out for themselves because if you want to know, we are a animal species. Now, what this means is that most of the time we are capable of backstabbing and capable of doing many things. Now, in life you will have some friends. Real friends are almost like family. These are the kind of friends that you would never do onto them what you would want done on yourself. Actually, what you wouldn't want done on yourself, is what I should say. The old words of the Bible. And that's what it is, basically. If you, if you have a fake friend out there, he's not really a friend, because friends aren't fake. A real friend is somebody who would go to bat for you, and they would do anything for you. Because they are technically like an extension of your family, an extension of yourself. Now, number two was, why is everyone so judgmental? Well, we live in a capitalist, beautiful world. And this world is where everybody judges everybody else because we all want social stature. We want to be here, and we want others to be there. Because everybody wants to be on top. I mean, most people want to be on top. I want to be on top, someday, anyway. But, that's just what it is. People are judgmental because, number one, they're insecure about themselves, and number two, they want to find a spot within society's hierarchy. Other question is, why does life kick you when you're down? This is simple, because life is too much of a pussy to kick you when you're up. That's my answer to that. Now, we've got another question here from Megatron7799, which writes in, How do you get a girl to like you? Yeah, hard one. Actually, there is no answer to this, because you can't make anybody like you. You can't force liking upon somebody. Truth of the matter is, they're going to like you or not like you, and that's not a decision that you can make for them. You can, however, increase your odds of somebody liking you by being more what they're looking for, having the same kind of interests, liking the same things, you know, stuff like that. But don't go fooling somebody into thinking that you like these certain things or are this certain person, and later on they find out you're not because, guess what, eh, you're out. Oh. Another question, and the last question, I'm doing this a little quick, but... Anyway, hopefully this will generate more questions. The last question is from Althina Dana, which writes in, Hi, since you said we can ask a question here, ha ha ha, my question is, when are you going to make another video on killing those evil bugs? Laugh out loud. I love it when a real man can do something us girls can't do most of the time. Smiley face. She is referring to my Hornets video, which was a little popular on YouTube. Well, not popular, but, you know, it got a few hits. And uh, when I invaded the Hornet nests within my house and killed the Queen. Um, when am I going to do this again? Hopefully never. I did not like the experience the first time, and I don't look forward to doing it again. Now, that said, if I would have be required to do it, trust me, I'll put it on YouTube. And you guys will be able to see it. If they are killer bees and not hornets, then nah. 
I ain't doing it. Somebody else might do it. I'll film it, but I ain't gonna be in it. And as for the other part about this is, I love it when a real man can do something us girls can't do. Well, I wouldn't consider myself a real man because I killed a hornet nest with poison. Uh, anybody can do that. So basically, if I would have killed it with my bare hands, maybe, but by killing it with poison and stepping on the poor defenseless queen as it tried to go up the blade of grass for dear life, I don't consider myself very much of a real man, but I'll take the compliment anyways. Now, if you have any questions you want to ask me about anything at all, please do so. Write it in. Send me a video if you want to send me a video question. I might feature the video within my own. If you want to just do like the other people here have done, send them through me via in the comments field or send it to me via the email. That's fine. I'll try to get to as most of these as I can and I promise if I do get more of these, I will address them much sooner. So thanks again for watching and until next time, if you got a question, ask Dr. K.